Like, I can still see pushback <laughs> on the surface and then pushback rover around 20 kilometers under the ground. All right, I think that the Kerbals are... I actually have some fuel to spare. It's called... So we're going to build our gap no. in the ceiling no. here to be three kilometers. You can see if you open up the LMP menu, I'm actually uh, flying the RCS 2Z Island currently. I think that's that's good Kerbal size, right? Yeah, that's, that's good Kerbal size. Because their helmets are big as crap. Big head. Uh, <clears throat> Don't know who said that. <laughs> that would be me. Alright, so we're going to go do this, do this. This is a lot of drag, so I'm glad this is not a forward flying airplane. Robin, um, might want to double check your center of gravity to too. Center alone and yeah, stop jumping I need to up check on that. me. But first things first, I actually need to lower this thing down. Well, I want to. No, well, Robin. I think this is actually the, no, Robin. Yeah, this is the strongest. Send one So let's lower this entire craft down. Come on, that's not helpful, mod. I should be pretty close with my thrust lift. Shut it. Pretty. Hello. I'm not sure how close is pretty close. We're going to be getting almost Sandor. there. All right, so let's roll this down some. Hey. Kerbal, jump on there. Let me know how, how how's it fit. Hey, hey! I wish you could pick these Kerbals up and force them to like walk in places. I, I shut can... that off on mine to save RAM. Yeah, I don't, I don't have anything running around on my facilities. I I do that on my other computer, on my laptop, and obviously on the. I I prefer it to be off on my laptop because my laptop kind of. And oh, now oh, I'm oh, he almost landing. Walked Almost and if you to stop, I've successfully landed the RCS to the island on the uh, back on the runway. All right, they could just jump. They could just jump. With uh, if my plane picks uh, up too much, should I put air brakes on the electric bottom? Motor uh, propellant to spare. Uh, if, if your plane pitches up too much, then reduce your uh, pitch authority. Yeah, if you if you yeah. have too much authority, then just no. but. If you're, if it's just pitching up on flight, then your lift is too far forward. Yeah, you need to bring the center of lift behind the center of gravity. I just, I just saw double arrows. I saw a double arrow. I saw a double arrow. Did you guys see? No. Oh, it's not gonna do anything. Sandar. Those are really yeah, if it's fine until you drop the rocket, then you have balance issues. Yeah. I'm going to move the, uh, the RCS to the island off the runway and then push back. All right, let's see. So you're losing the weight of the rocket, and it's throwing the plane out of balance. Ooh, it's so close. It's so close. Although there still is some uh, monopropellant left, so I can just fire up the engines. For like a well, it's got the stock for like a so it has some torque, so you should be I able to save fuel. the physics torque it out of the way. Push back. All right, so I think this is ready. And the pushback can actually fit under the RCS to the island's wings. Okay, now take it up and see if it works. <laughs> Usually when you take it back, all of a sudden it's going to uh, change everything and you're like, okay, 